Breakfast is often called the most important meal of the day, and for good reason. As the name suggests, breakfast breaks the overnight fasting period. It replenishes your supply of glucose to boost your energy levels and alertness, while also providing other essential nutrients required for good health. Many studies have shown the health benefits of eating breakfast. It improves your energy levels and the ability to concentrate in the short term, and can help with better weight management, reduce risk of type 2 diabetes and heart disease in the long term. Despite the benefits of breakfast, your health and well-being, many people often skip it for a variety of reasons. The good news is there are plenty of ways to make it easier to fit breakfast into your day. Energy the body's energy source is glucose. Glucose is broken down and absorbed from the carbohydrates you eat. The body stores most of its energy as fat, but your body also stores some glucose as glycogen, most of it in your liver, with smaller amounts in your muscles. During times of fasting, such as overnight, the liver breaks down glycogen and releases it into your bloodstream as glucose to keep your blood sugar level stable. This is especially important for your brain, which relies almost entirely on glucose for energy. In the morning, after you have gone without food for as long as 12 hours, your glycogen stores are low. Once all of the energy from your glycogen stores is used up, your body starts to break down fatty acids to produce the energy it needs. But without carbohydrate, fatty acids are only partially oxidized, which can reduce your energy levels. Eating breakfast boosts your energy levels and restores your glycogen levels ready to keep up with your metabolism for the day. Skipping breakfast may seem like a good way to reduce overall energy intake, but research shows that even with a higher intake of energy, breakfast eaters tend to be more physically active in the morning than those who don't eat until later on in the day. Essential Vitamins, Minerals, and Nutrients now, breakfast foods are rich in key nutrients such as folate, calcium, iron, B vitamins, and fiber. Breakfast provides a lot of your day's total nutrient intake. In fact, people who eat breakfast are more likely to meet their recommended daily intakes of vitamins and minerals than people who don't. Essential vitamins, minerals, and other nutrients can only be gained from food, so even though your body can usually find enough energy to make it to the next meal, you still need to top up your vitamin and mineral levels to maintain health and vitality. Breakfast helps you control your weight. People who regularly eat breakfast are less likely to be overweight or obese. Research is ongoing as to why this is the case. It is thought that eating breakfast may help you control your weight because it prevents large fluctuations in your blood glucose levels, helping you to control your appetite. Breakfast fills you up before you become really hungry, so you're less likely to just grab whatever foods are nearby when hunger really strikes. For example, high energy, high fat foods with added sugars or salt. Breakfast boosts brain power. If you don't have breakfast, you might find yourself feeling a bit sluggish and struggle to focus on things. This is because your brain hasn't received the glucose it needs to get going. Studies suggest that not having breakfast affects your mental performance, including your attention, ability to concentrate, and memory. This can make some tasks feel harder than they normally would. Children and adolescents who regularly eat breakfast also tend to perform better academically compared with those who skip breakfast. They also feel a greater level of connectedness with teachers and other adults at their school, which leads to further positive health and academic outcomes. A healthy breakfast may reduce the risk of illnesses. Compared with people who don't have breakfast, those who regularly eat breakfast tend to have a lower risk of both obesity and type 2 diabetes. There is also some evidence that people who don't have breakfast may be at a higher risk of cardiovascular disease. Breakfast helps you make better food choices. People who eat breakfast generally have more healthy diets overall have better eating habits and are less likely to be hungry for snacks during the day than people who skip breakfast. Children who eat an inadequate breakfast are more likely to make poor food choices not only for the rest of the day, but also over the long term. Some common reasons for skipping breakfast include not having enough time or wanting to spend the extra time being in bed, trying to lose weight, too tired to bother, bored of the same breakfast foods, don't feel hungry in the morning, no breakfast foods available in the house, the cost of buying the breakfast foods, and other cultural reasons. 
While skipping breakfast is not recommended, good nutrition is not just about the number of meals you have each day. If you don't have breakfast, aim to make up for the nutritional content you missed at breakfast with your lunch and dinner. If you're time poor, you can still have breakfast. Early starts, long commutes, and busy morning schedules means many of us don't make time to sit down to eat breakfast before heading out for the day. Whatever your reason is for being time poor in the morning, there are still ways that you can fit in breakfast. 1. Prepare some quick and healthy breakfast foods the night before or on the weekend. 2. Keep some breakfast foods at work if allowed to enjoy once you arrive. 3. Get in the habit of setting your alarm for 10 to 15 minutes earlier than usual to give yourself time to have breakfast at home. 4. Swap out any time-wasting habits in the morning such as checking your emails or scrolling through social media and use this time to make breakfast for yourself. Can't face food in the morning? Well, some people find they just can't tolerate food first thing in the morning, perhaps because they have their last meal of the day quite late at night or they don't find typical breakfast foods appealing, or because food first thing in the morning turns their stomach. If it's hard for you to eat food in the morning, well, you might like to try reducing the size of your meals in the evening and eating them earlier so you're hungry in the morning. Or you can try looking for some new recipes and stocking your cupboards with some different types of foods to increase your breakfast appetite. Okay guys, that was it for today's video. I hope it was a helpful one. Thank you so much. It was a pleasure having you all here. If you haven't already, click the subscribe, bell, and like button. And also share your thoughts down in the comment section below. Thank you so much. Have a great day and a fantastic one, everyone. Goodbye.